Hello all, I am Navya. I am studying in Ignite IS. I am pursuing intermediate first year MPC. So I am here to explain about ocean currents and their types. First of all, what are ocean currents? Ocean currents are channels of water moving in a particular direction in the oceans. Simply, ocean currents are like rivers in the oceans. They are, currents are generally measured in meter per second or in knots also. There are some factors that are influencing the movement of the ocean currents. Firstly, temperature. Firstly, temperature. Heating by solar energy causes the water to expand. That means thermal expansion. Thermal expan because of thermal expansion near the equator, the ocean currents are 8 centimeters higher in level than the middle latitudes. This causes a very slight gradient and water tends to flow down the slope. This, this height gradient is created as a result of the temperature. The water in the lower latitude gaining a height and moves towards the higher latitudes but then what direction will it take in which direction in which path will it go that is something which is determined by the movement of the winds and the second factor is about the winds the winds that are blowing on the ocean surface pushes the water friction between the winds and the water surface affects the movement of the water water body in its course and the third factor is about coriolis force the Coriolis force intervenes and causes the water to move towards the right in the northern hemisphere and to the left in the southern hemisphere. And the next factor is about salinity. As the salinity increases, the water density also increases. As the salinity decreases, the water density also decreases. And now we will talk about types of currents. Based on depth, the ocean currents are divided into two. Surface currents. Surface currents accounts for 10% of the Surface currents account for 10% of the ocean water and the, the winds may move the top 400 meters of the water uh, resulting in the formation of the surface ocean currents and the next one is about deep water currents. Deep water currents deep water, current, deep water currents accounts for the remaining 90% of the ocean water. These currents move on the ocean basin due to the variation in the density and gravity. These currents are also known as thermohaline circulations. Next we will talk about based on temperature the ocean currents are again divided into two. Warm ocean currents. These are the currents which flow from the low latitudes of tropical zones towards the high latitudes of temperate zones and subpolar zones. They bring warm water into cold water areas. And the next one is about cold ocean currents. These currents have having a lower surface temperature and they bring cold water into warm water areas. These currents flow from the high latitudes of polar regions towards the low latitudes of warm equatorial region. Example Labrador currents. So, here are some few important currents that are Gulf Stream, Labrador Current, Kurosho Current and Californian Current. Thank you.